What astronauts really eat in space? Imagine going camping for more than a week with several of your close friends. You'd make sure you had plenty of food and gear to cook and eat with. The food would have to be stored properly and would be non-perishable to avoid spoilage. After finishing your meal or at the end of your camping trip, you would then stow all your gear and dispose of your trash properly just before the ride home. Astronauts basically do the same thing when they go to space. Preparation varies with the food type. Some foods can be eaten in their natural form, such as brownies and fruit. Other foods require adding water, such as macaroni and cheese or spaghetti. Of course, an oven is provided in the space station to heat foods to the proper temperatures. There are no refrigerators in space, so space food must be stored and prepared properly to avoid spoilage, especially on longer missions. Condiments such as ketchup, mustard, and mayonnaise are provided. Salt and pepper are available, but only in liquid form. This is because astronauts can't sprinkle salt and pepper on their food in space. The salt and pepper would simply float away. There is a danger they could clog air vents, contaminate equipment, or get stuck in an astronaut's eyes, mouth, or nose. Astronauts eat three meals a day, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Nutritionists ensure the food astronauts eat provides them with a balanced supply of vitamins and minerals. From pureed food and aluminum tubes to fresh lettuce growing in a microgravity environment, what astronauts eat in space is constantly changing. Today, astronauts can enjoy a shrimp cocktail on the International Space Station or request extra hot sauce for their meals, and space food will continue to evolve as technology improves. Salad in Space One of the biggest struggles for astronauts in space is the lack of fresh vegetables and fruit. However, in recent years, the crew on the International Space Station has grown its own romaine lettuce. The plants grow inside the vegetable production system unit on the station that resembles a small greenhouse. During the initial experiment, it took more than 30 days for the lettuce to be ready to harvest. Nevertheless, this is a positive step toward providing the crew with fresh produce during long missions. In the future, astronauts may be able to supplement their diets with a variety of vegetables and fruit in space. Pizza and Ice Cream when 7,400 pounds of supplies went to the International Space Station in 2017, the astronauts received a special treat of pizza and ice cream, items they requested because they missed some of the comforts of home. But these delicious treats aren't a normal part of the menu in space. NASA's food scientist, Takaya Sermons, explains that ice cream is rare because it requires refrigeration and freezers. It's important to note that the astronaut's ice cream seen in grocery stores never makes it to space. The freeze-dried dessert is a fun novelty, but CNET reports that flight crews did not get the chance to sample it on their missions. One of the reasons why astronaut ice cream stays on Earth may be because it creates dangerous crumbs that can affect the equipment and the people. Instead, the crew occasionally gets to enjoy regular ice cream that does not carry the risk of crumbs destroying a machine or getting in their eyes. More hot sauce. Although astronauts can eat, chew, and drink many things in space, Sermon shares that their perception of taste changes. The microgravity causes fluid changes and gives them congestion. This affects the crew's ability to smell and taste, so the flavor of food is different. In general, they prefer spicier food in space to compensate for the loss of taste. Astronauts have access to a variety of condiments and spices, including hot sauce in space. The crew gets a variety of products like Louisiana hot sauce, salt, pepper, wasabi, and Tabasco. Shrimp cocktail is a beloved dish among astronauts, despite being freeze-dried because it's spicy. The future of space food. From growing fresh produce to 3D printing meals, space food will continue to change in the future. Advances in technology may make it possible to do long-term and large-scale space farming, so crews will have an ongoing supply of food. Looking beyond the International Space Station and other missions, the ability to grow and harvest food is a crucial part of space exploration and may determine the viability of colonizing other planets. According to the University of Hawaii, a mission to Mars may take two and a half years, so growing food on the flight will be necessary. Farming would provide all the necessary nutrients and give them variety. It would also boost morale because caring for living things is important to humans. 3D printing food is another option. Futurism reports that the startup B-Hex has used a 3D printer robot to make a pizza. The process takes about six minutes and produces a pizza that looks like what we'd expect. 
A computer controls the dough, shape, and toppings, and tubes with nozzles push out all the ingredients in the right order. For astronauts who miss cooking at home, this type of machine would be an easy way to make their own meals.